When you have logged into Plan, you'll see that you have five tabs at the top. In order to create your goals for the coming year, you'll go into My Professional Growth Plan. When you open it, you'll see you have two tabs. Um, the first time you come here, you'll see Start Plan and the Current Growth Plan. And you also have a list of your former uh, plans from years before. To start your plan, we're going to click Start Plan. And you'll see there are four containers, and each of them have two activities. To expand that container, I just click Contains Two Activities, and I'll see the two things that I need to do first. One of them is to identify my supervisor. That's simply the person who will be looking at my goals and commenting on them and commenting on my reflections through the years. The other is a self-assessment. So let's go into Identifying Supervisor. You can put as many supervisors as you want here, as many people as you care to put. will be able to see your plan and look at what you're doing. In order to add them, click New User. And then just type their name in. And search. Then just check to make sure that the name is right, their email is correct, the place that they work. All of this information is correct. Put a check in the box that you have chosen them. In some cases, there may be several people with close to the same name. And then add that selected user. Now you have added a supervisor. If during the year your principal were to change or your mentor, you can remove this person click just by clicking the Remove button. When you have completed your plan, when you complete your reflections, and when you complete your final reflection, these people will receive an email um, reminding them to go in and take a look at your work.